What's going on everybody? Got a mail day here today. Hope everybody had a good weekend. Uh, should be a quick mail day here today. Got only four packages here, so shouldn't have to keep you guys too long. Let's get started. Um, haven't really been buying too many boxes. Uh, just mainly buying singles off eBay again. I, I did uh, buy one box, which I'm pretty excited to open. Uh, I'll show you guys at the end of the video what it's gonna be. This is a sweet card. Um, I got this on eBay um, for I think $3 and change. Um, and I also had my eBay bucks for April, May, and June that I used towards this. So I only paid like a dollar. Um, and it is, if I can get the tape off of here. Let me get the tape off here real quick. I'm not sure what kind of tape you use, that is weird. I'll need a new top loader after this. That's weird. Um, but it is out of 2014 Elite. It is the purple die cut Elite status out of 17. 8 of 17. So it's a sweet card. There's the back. If it looks good, I might have to, to get it graded. I do see some white chipping over here in the black area over here. Which, I mean, that's somewhat common, so. But that's a nice card, though. Next up, I think this is from a group break. Or a player break, I think I should say. Um, I got in a couple case breaks uh, this past week. For, uh, for Philip Rivers. As well as Zach Levine. I don't know if I hit anything. I know I hit something in the Philip Rivers one. So Zach Levine, I think I was shut out on, but we'll see here. He just uh, shipped them both together, which is cool. I did hit, okay, so I did miss this one, I guess. I did not know, or I did not think that I hit one, but I hit a base card here at a 269. So it's not bad. And then out of, oh yeah, that was a five case break, by the way. So like, I think that was like 40 some boxes of gold standard. I think there's only eight cards in a pack or in a box. So, and then my Philip Rivers cards. I got in, I think, a two case break of the new 2017 Elite football. And I got a base card, which is cool. Um, a fired up insert. Numbered to 299. I do like these inserts. That's probably my favorite insert set so far this year out of any product. I just like that photography and the background and stuff. It just looks cool. And this is cool. Out of 24, I think this is the Elite Aspirations pink or purple. I don't know what it's called, but that's a nice die cut though. So. So that's that, out of some group breaks. All right, next up here. Okay, yeah, this is cool. Um, just bought a single off of eBay for the, from the new 2017 Undisputed from WWE. This is just the base autograph. Trying to get this tape off here real quick. This is the base autograph, number two, 199 of Sasha Banks. So nice autograph there. That's my first one out of Undisputed so far this year. Of Sasha anyway, so. It's a nice one there. And finally, let's see what we got in this one. <laughs> That's funny. So, I didn't, uh, I think I bought this one like a day or two before I bought into that case break 
of 2017 Elite for Phillip Rivers. And then I go ahead and pull one. <laughs> also, the pink or purple Elite Aspirations to 24. <laughs> so that's unfortunate. Uh, I may just keep one and try and send the better one off to get graded, possibly. So, Still an awesome looking card, though. So can't complain. Got this for a, a few bucks, I think. Maybe it was like a dollar or two plus shipping. So that's really all I ever buy. I don't buy stuff that's like 20 bucks or best offer. I mean, a lot of these low short prints early on when the product uh, first releases, people put it up for like ridiculous amounts. I only go after stuff that's on auction, like low, low priced auctions, because a lot of the time that stuff just tends to sit there and not and not get bidded on. So. I'll take that stuff all day long at low prices like that. So that's it guys, um, thanks for watching. I do have a box coming up here, a box break. I picked this up yesterday and I'm really excited to open this. The new 2017 certified. So it's got four autos or mem cards. It's usually two autos and two mem cards. So I know one RPA. It'd be cool to get an RPA of this guy here, but We'll see, I doubt it. And this box was $100, so it's not cheap, but it's one of the cheaper ones so far this year. So look forward to that. Uh, thanks for watching, guys, and I'll be back with this box break later in the week.